So unfortunately, my video editor, she deleted by mistake some of the footages. So, you know, mistakes happen. It is what it is. Bonder ECU. So I'm just going to make a quick video to show you guys. So this covers 2000 and seven Toyota Camry all the way up to 2010 the, Toyota Camry. You see thing right there. In case you guys are interested in seeing that. I guess if not. Have to whatever. Unclip this. And I'm just gonna squeeze out the ECU. I would attempt to do that. And you have to remove this whole dashboard in order to access it. The easy way to do it is to loosen these outer screws right here these bolts they look something like this you just remove this side there's a bolt right here bolt here there and everywhere and you just lift this up you kind of force it back there are also some outer screws that you would have to access from under the hood here there's another one over there and these they're under here here's the other one right there and you're just gonna pull it out a little bit to about right here so this is about an inch so you can get your hands if you got big hands like mine or similar it'll give you enough clearance for you to get back here so the ECU is tucked back here and you'll be able to get it and it's located back here the harness stands right there so it's definitely a troop definitely a mission to get to this ecu but that's what it is your boy precision connections at precisionconnectionsauto.com this is my friend's car. He doesn't want the ECU back here in case he has to do some more diagnostics. So I'm just gonna put it back in the rack. We'll have to find the appropriate screws. So you wanna take this screw, thread it into the hole, and it's going to thread out on the other side. And the screw, if you guys can see it, I don't know, my hands are shaky. I haven't had breakfast this morning, but it's not going to stop me from getting it in. All right, so we got those in. Then you want to access the screws that's outside. So, slide this in I don't know where he got this car from but it gotta be cheap this car is tow up from the flip right, let me just snake these harnesses Get the speaker wire plugged back in. Okay. It's my speaker harness. I got that nice one handed. It takes years of training to get the one handed move down pack okay just gotta snap this in Plugging back the airbag. Before you do anything, you gotta unplug the airbag. Make sure that the airbag control module is unplugged. Don't ever forget that. Or you're gonna have a couple of issues. 
that you're gonna have to deal with later on. And it's gonna be really expensive if you don't have the proper tools to get it in. All right, whoa. Okay, that's in.